What's going on guys? So Dungeon is here and I'm going to show you how to farm char hides. So here's one place, Nolani Academy. We just run in here, just go here, pull the lever for the gate. Uh, you know, basically a Voss build would work pretty well. They're low level char so you can just kill them in one hit pretty much. If you have like a block or some kind of like health regeneration, you should do just fine. So I just like take them out. And I'm going to show you like a couple places to actually farm them. Because this isn't my favorite place to do it. So here it is right here. Go and just kill some of them. Like, it's pretty easy to do. Like just takes a couple hits. And there's also a good amount of foes. So you can just keep going in here and just keep killing them over and over and over again. If you want to. And also keep the char carvings because they're a nick item for later on. And I got like one char hide from that entire thing. Um, which I actually like, you know, do not prefer that. I prefer to do it at Fort Rannick. I think this is a much better place to do it. So I basically, you basically just run through here like this. And you can kill some of the char along the way. But, which is what I do. But the thing about it is that once you get like towards the end, there's going to be like this really massive group of char. And like pretty much the entire, all the foes on the map are char. I think it might actually be every single foe on the map is char. So you can actually just run around here and kill some groups and be good to go. Bring like a speed boost, kind of like what I did. And I'll also like link the builds in the description down below. So just go right through here. And I think the drops are also like a little bit better. Like it just seems like there's a higher chance of actually getting the char hides. Because like, I, in, you see there's like a really big group right over there to the left, as you can see. So you just run right up here. And you pretty much take them out extremely quickly if you run a build like what I'm doing. Just one hit pretty much takes them all out. Not much of a problem at all. You can also farm them like outside of Pike and Square, but... Or, or really like any other area where they're at. It's just that I think that, you know, the two places that I'm showing you are actually the best. I think this right here is the best actually, in my opinion. Because it's like, look, there's like a bunch of char carvings and a bunch of char hides and everything that have dropped. Like, there's literally two of them just like right there behind me. Char hide, char hide. And some carvings and everything. And you can still run around and kill like other like separate groups if you wanted to. Just like that. Yeah, so this is like really my preferred method. Like I already got like six of them. I got five this run and I got one the previous run. At the other mission. But it's like, you know, like really easy. You just like take that path. Just go towards the back. And yeah, and as you can see, there's like other groups around here. Like they're usually in groups of three. So you can just run through there and kill them if you like need some extra ones. If you wanted to, you can just like redo the mission if you really need to, but probably not. And yeah, I'm going to show you some of the runes. I'm not really like heavily runed up or anything. Like they're not strong foes or anything, so you can beat them relatively easy. And it's just basically a Voss build and also put some running skills in there so I can get through it quicker. And I'm going to go ahead and show you the run to Nick. So make sure you have your five char hides because that's all you need go to pike and square and we're going to just kind of like run right down there kind of like that it's like a really easy simple basic thing so just go out here and you just kind of like run down here and just kind of like go down the left side you don't really need to use shadow form or anything like they're weak they they can't really do too much damage to you And, yeah, so it's right up here. Really easy to do. And there we go. Give them five. Get our five gifts of the Traveler. Really easy to do. And, yeah, I mean, to, this week right here is just really easy. Uh, you know, the two missions are actually really good to basically farm these in. It gets, it's just easy, good, and simple. And that's the way I like it. So Dungeon is signing out and stay tuned for next week's Nick's, Nick item, which is much more difficult to get.